Greetings everyone, welcome to the Essence of Life Tarot, thank you so much for tuning in. So this reading is for the sign of Libra, for all sun, moon, rising and Venus signs, also cross watchers as well, so thank you everyone for watching. Hope you guys are good and doing well. So to start this reading, I'll give you these messages to outline the reading we have, separation. It says time apart from your partner is on the horizon. We have reconciliation. It says someone from your past is returning to your life. And we have chemistry. It says there's a strong magnetic attraction here. So that's the messages for this reading, separation, reconciliation and chemistry. So I'll lay out the tarot so we can tap into the current energies in this situation. Let's see what spirit wants you to know. So I'll do a free card spread. We've got the lovers, Gemini energy. We've got ten of swords. And we've got the chariot, Cancer energy. So you could have Gemini in your chart, or you're dealing with someone that's got Gemini in their chart. We've got Cancer here as well. So I'll clarify these cards, get some more insight. King of Cups, Eight of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles. Then we've got the Four of Pentacles. We've got Strength, Leo Energy and Temperance, Sagittarius Energy. Okay, so... Right, so we have the lovers. First card out. Wow, so this reading is showing that for those of you, if you are single, <laughs> you have love coming in, you know, this, and this is not no ordinary love either. Yeah, with this lover's energy, this is not no ordinary love. This is like true love, divine love, you know, meant to be yeah definitely it looks like someone is you know heading towards a divine union here this is what's taking place i can see in this situation the universe is bringing you and your person together this is the goal here we've got temperance here as well so yeah the universe is definitely behind this we've got a chariot here as well Strength card, a lot of major arcanas here, strong universal energies. So uh, this is destiny taking place, it looks like. Fated events. It's inevitable. You and this person is meant to be together. Yeah. We have reconciliation. So this is what's taking place. You guys are going to be reunited. So it looks like for some of you, it does look like you and this person are in separation. But that's coming to an end. This is what's going on. That's coming to an end. You're going to be reunited again with this person. Yeah, I feel like you crossed paths with this person in the past. You know, you did cross paths with this person here. You know, I feel like, uh, you know, it was a one-sided situation. Yeah, because, yeah, but I'm, I'm picking up this masculine, this king of cups here. This King of Cups is holding back their feelings, Four of Pentacles. They were holding back. So it led to a separation. This is what I'm getting for some of you. Yeah, it, this reading is picking up, you know, a masculine energy here. That is working towards, you know, reuniting here. Yeah, with their true love. Wow. It does look like um, it was a choice. It was a choice. I feel like what caused separation was uh, someone in this situation had a choice to make. Yeah, I feel like this masculine, they had a choice to make. They probably made a poor choice and it led to, you know, you guys being separated here. Because with the lovers here, it represents making choices in love and in life, making healthy choices. So 
yeah, I feel like whoever they did choose in the past didn't work out. We have the Ten of Swords here. There is, so there is an ending. So, yeah, it looks like this masculine here is going through a transition. This is what's going on. They're going through a life-changing transition right now in their life. They are closing out a toxic relationship here that they chose over this relationship with you. Yeah. They they go through a separation. Time apart from your partner is on the horizon. Yeah, this person is going through a separation right now with someone that they chose here. Yeah, it looks like a painful, painful ending. Things came to an end, yeah. It really didn't work out. So, yeah, that, it looks like they're going through a time of, um, you know, severing ties here with a relationship that didn't work out here. And uh, in return, that is leading this person to who they're supposed to be. They're being guided here to be with someone that they're supposed to be with. Yeah, they are being blessed with the strength as well. To persevere. It's challenging times. Yeah, I feel like this person is going through a challenging, you know, challenging time right now. They are processing a lot of um challenging emotions because it's a tough it's a tough ending, it looks like closing out this this relationship. It looks like it's tough to deal with, but they are being blessed with the strength right now. Someone's prayers is being heard. Yeah. Because I can see someone is persevering during this time. During this tough time. This eight of pentacles. Here, three of pentacles, the chariot. Someone is persevering, strength here. Finding that inner strength to, to carry on. Through this challenging time. Yeah, because like they say, when the going gets tough... The tough get going. This is what I can see here. It's like someone is really finding that inner strength, you know, and resilience to persevere and keep moving forward, regardless of the circumstances. This is what I can see. Yeah, someone, for some of you, I feel like, you know, the chemistry is strong. The chemistry is strong. That's what's driving this person, you know, because someone here, the King of Cups, I mean, the emotions, the, the feelings are real. Like, someone's really in love here. This masculine is in love. I feel like they are being guided to follow their heart. Yeah. Because uh, the feelings are real. The chemistry is strong in this, in this connection. Here, you guys are meant to be. But it, I feel like in order for you guys to like really have a successful, you know, reunion here and relationship moving forward, this is something that you both have to choose. You know, this is making choices. So you both have to choose to want this relationship in order for it to be successful. So it requires, you know, work and effort on both parts. You both have to make the effort here. This is what I can see. So it looks like, you know, this masculine is on board. Because we've got the lovers upright here. We've got the temperance here. So there's balance. Three of pentacles. So this masculine is finally on board with this connection now. They are choosing, you know, this path of true love. Following their heart here and putting in the work. Yeah, three of pentacles, working together here, teamwork. Yeah, this masculine's on board now, they're fully in, ready to move forward, leave the past behind, and start something new here. Yeah, reconciliation. They're on board, they're making that choice, it's a healthy choice, yeah. For some of you, you know, I really feel like this this masculine, you know, they are um, dedicated to working on themselves. Eight of Pentacles as well. Three of Pentacles. This, this is someone that's dedicated to actually working on themselves to be a better person. 
this is what I'm getting as well. Because that's what it's going to require, you know, for you both to be, for you both to know who you really are. And for you to know who you really are, you're going to have to work on yourself every day. Every day is constant. It's a lot of hard work as well when you're working on yourself. <laughs> It is a lot of hard work, but it's necessary. It's successful, though. With Eight of Pentacles here. Three of Pentacles. Yeah, there is success here. A lot of success is happening right about now. Someone is focused on success. I can see this masculine is focused on being successful in this situation. Yeah, bless them. They're going through, you know, this transition and, you know, it's really life-changing. It's really changing this person for the better. Oh, bless them. Oh, so, yeah, I feel like uh, you guys are on board here. You're both on board. You're, you're both on the same team. Yeah, we've got f further insight, coughing, endings, bring new beginnings, growth, change, liberation, transition. This is what I'm saying. This is what's happening. Major transition, life-changing transition is happening here. Yeah, rest in peace. So, rest in peace to the past. Yeah, someone is really closing out a past relationship or situation that was unhealthy. Yeah, putting it to putting it to rest now. Focus on the new beginning. Focus on growth, change. Yeah, yeah, we've got masks as well. Someone's not showing their feelings though. They're hiding, pretending. I feel like someone, I feel like this masculine is pretending to be happy right now. But really, they are sad. But they're showing a face to the world that everything's okay. They're not showing their true feelings. They're hiding their true feelings. They're pretending that everything's all right to the world. But deep down, they are sad. Because we've got the Ten of Swords here. It's a it's a painful ending. Closing out this chapter is painful. So it does take it's gonna it does take a lot of courage here with the strength. This person is being blessed with courage and strength to persevere and to keep moving forward here. It does take courage to let go, you know, of a way of life or a way of thinking or being. Yeah. And start something new. Step in the name of faith. It's challenging. It's really challenging. But, you know, someone's trying to put on a brave face here, I feel. They're trying to put on a brave face. This is why we've got mask. Why they persevere through this challenging time. Yeah. But they're not showing their true feelings. Deep down, this person is suffering. They are. It's painful. It's, they're sad. They are depressed. But, like I said... They're still trying to persevere here. It's tough times. Tough times. Yeah, but they're being blessed here. They're, they are surrounded with, you know, angelic uh, presence. Yeah, yeah, ascending, helping this person to ascend, transcend obstacles, learning, expansion, new phase. Yeah, making healthy choices in love and in life. Yeah, we've got love calls. Someone expresses love, a message of love, thinking of you, letting you know. So, yeah, reconciliation. Yeah, we've got a date. Meeting someone new, getting back out there. Setting a date. Coffee cup, meeting, conversing, savouring the moment, feeling uplifted, friendship. Yeah, new beginnings, new beginnings. Oh, it's love, unconditional love, self-love, oneness, passion, affection, attraction. Yeah, it's true love here. Stability, yeah. Growth. We've got the palm tree here. Permanence, growth. Wow. I'm telling you, this person moving forward, you know, this, this uh, reunion is going to be uh, one of a kind, definitely. It is one of a kind, yeah. Angel answers, helpful people. Yeah, helpful people during this time it is helping someone to, to uh, persevere here. We've got remain positive as well. Yeah, it's important to remain positive. That speeds up the process. It helps with the healing and uh, helps bring you guys together. And we have success. This is what I'm saying. It's a success, you guys. You guys are on the same team. That is beautiful. So I hope this reading helps. See you soon.